welcome back to the vlog and this vlog we are going to be seeing a lot of Sweden because I did a race in Sweden and my results obviously so let's get right into it after my race on Sunday we went straight to Germany where we had a hotel book just one kilometer before our ferry that we needed to take in the morning So we just arrived at our hotel here in Germany, uh, which is only one kilometer from the ferry that we need to take in the morning. So we're going to take a rest because it's 11 o'clock at night and then tomorrow we can take the ferry to <sighs> Massey. Yeah. We can take the ferry to Denmark. Oh, and then <laughs> we can't go from Denmark to Sweden. Oh, so bye. Good morning, everyone. It is the 5th of October and it is. Wait. It's 8.15 or 8.16. And we're going to have to take the boat at 8.45. So we're going to go and go to Denmark. I became very cranky in the car because I was just so fucking tired and I just really wanted to arrive so now we're here so the day after we arrived we went for a little ride and we thought we would see a lot of nature but Massimo made the route and it was mostly consisting out of real bike trails as you can see, there were lots and lots and lots of turns. We had a great uh, surface to ride on and that was everything was alright, but it wasn't uh, what we thought we we were going to see on this ride. We thought we were going to see a lot of nature and a lot of beautiful Sweden, but we mostly just drove around uh, houses and here we made a wrong turn <laughs> so as you can see we mostly just ride between houses and we have a lot of corners but we have a great surface to ride on though it was really fun we had a great weather no rain nothing it was a good temperature so that was all right and we really liked this ride Yesterday we had a lot of fun on our ride, today we really wanted to see the beautiful land of Sweden. So we took the car and we rode uh, 30 kilometers up north uh, and there we stopped and we picked the bikes out of the car and we went for a three hour and a half ride and it was very lovely. Just wait and see.
After our ride today, I completely fell in love with Sweden and everything it has to offer. Their nature, their roads, even when cars would pass us by, they would do it so safely with a two meter distance. After today's ride, we actually went to Stockholm and Massimo was very impressed by this staircase because he had never seen something like this before. Then in the city, we had seen some art and lovely architecture. I didn't get that much footage though because it was getting quite late and I was just taking it all in. So I'm sorry for that. But we got to see some nice things. We bought some sweets also for our moms and our friends and we had a very lovely day. So it's a day after our little adventure to Stockholm and our trail ride. Today we're going to do a recon of the course. At first we thought it was going to be at two different places, at Tabe and then one in Stockholm because it says like this also in the UCI calendar, but it's at the same place twice. So let's see how the course looks. Even though the course looked like this, the day after it was completely different and the day after that it was completely different also so it was a very strange course the first lap i did i wasn't convinced of my capacities and i wasn't feeling that great also but the day after it would be better and the day after that it would be more better i don't know <laughs> That was a bad English, but I'm sorry. Just enjoy the course.
So it is Saturday morning. I sleep terrible, absolutely terrible last night. Uh, there was a lot going on outside. A woman and a man were screaming, then a dog and a lot of everything. So yeah, let's see how it works out today. Because as you can see, I'm still tired. Well, so first day CU race of the season, and I had a fifth place. I have, oh no, I've, I've become fifth, fifth place in the pocket for me. Ah, <sighs> I'm very happy with that. Last year, uh, I had a fifth place in. China and that was actually my best result in a UCR race so to get a fifth place so early in the season I'm happy with that also it was extremely muddy and rainy so Mosmo did not bring the GoPro with him because he had a lot of work to do and it was raining so we didn't want to get the GoPro wet so I don't have that much footage of today's race I'm very sorry for that but just look at my legs I've already cleaned them and I just can't get them off because it's so sort of clay and I just oh it, it hurts like the difference between my two legs. So the Saturday we found out that actually we stayed at Hasselby Beach. So we went and checked it out after the race. It was extremely beautiful and here you have me. And I'm crazy. Well Morning everybody, it is Sunday morning for us here and as you can see we packed the car, everything is inside, we removed everything from the apartment here yeah. and now I am ready for my last day of racing here in Sweden, in Tabe. so wish me luck. Yesterday it was a good race, I was very pleased with it afterwards. Um, it was only my second race, so I'm really happy with that. So let's hope today will be better, a better result. Let's hope so, and we will see. Because today it is sunny, as you can see, and yesterday it was rainy. So, so as you can see, the course completely changed from Saturday to Sunday. It was a bit more wet because it rained all day yesterday. Um, so yeah, let's see what today brings. I already know it, of course, but you don't know yet. Today I became 4th and this is also my best UCI result that I got so far so I'm really pleased with that. After the race we went straight home because we still had a long journey ahead. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and we will see you on the next one. Bye!